Hello, in this channel, I'm gonna be sharing with you different DIYs that you're not only gonna use them for yourself, but you're gonna be able to sell them. My goal is to turn your hobbies into a business. Welcome back to another video. This is Norma Acosta with Mommy's DIYs. And today I'm very happy to show you and share with you how I made this uh, clock. I have been buying the clocks from uh, coastalbusiness.com and they're uh, a lot more expensive if for some reason because my printers uh, only print eight and a half by 11 and that one is bigger. So it just didn't work out for me. But these ones I got, I got quite a few I got them at uh, Walmart and I got them all sale for $3.99 very easy to work with and they they're not expensive at all so we're gonna go ahead and do these and for this video we're gonna be using one clock and then we're gonna we're gonna be using the screwdriver to uh, take it apart uh, you can decide whether you want a glitter I want to do glitter like this one this one has glitter uh, you can either do glitter, and I'm gonna put the links of all the products that I use in the in the description below, or you can use this bright white uh, cardstock. Okay, you're gonna need the, some do double-sided tape. You're gonna need some scissors. You're gonna need uh, something like this that it's the the round that we need for that, uh, or you can either. Um, print a circle, a, a 7.3 circle or in printed in cardstock. So that can be like your, your uh, pattern. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start and take it apart. Uh, also, I found these that I may be able to um, use them. They, these, are, these are Swarovski, the, sh the family liked. So I may use them and I may not. I'll let you know on that. So it's, it's very easy to, uh, if you've already done this work before and know how to take it apart, go ahead and skip a little bit of this video. But basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna unscrew the back. The back. Okay, we're gonna unscrew that. And to take it apart is really, really easy. But if you don't know how to do it, it's like, oops, <laughs> you don't know what to do. So basically what we're going to do, we're going to unscrew this, uh, this here and I, I'm using this kind of a screw to, to take it apart. So there's four six to take apart. So all six are completely uh, taken apart. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out. Put this one on the side. They have them in silver, in white, and in black. Okay, so now very carefully what you're gonna do is this one on top, which is the one that uh, uh, moves with the seconds. You're gonna, be t you're gonna turn it so that it unscrews. And there it is. Okay, so we're gonna put it aside. And then we're just gonna pull these carefully. They're not a screw anymore. They just, you need to pull them out just like that, put them aside. When you print the picture, you need to make sure and, and see where is the image gonna be. Because sometimes I did one, the first one I did, the face, the face of the baby, uh, I made it in such a way that the middle part was right on the nose. So I had to, I had to make another one. Now you can get a template. You can just go on Google and put clock, clock face uh, images and pick whatever, whatever uh, one you like. And that's the one you're going to use. And that's what I did. So this is already open and done. Let me move to the computer so that we continue with the next step. We are back, so we're gonna be using an inkjet printer. If you don't have an inkjet, you can use a, a, the regular printer, uh, but I know that the pictures come up much, much better in, in ink, using an inkjet. 
so now um, I try making my design in uh, pages, which is the, the, the application for iMac. And I tried doing it in other, through other sources. And I found out that through Google Docs, I was able to get it better because the pictures will jump away from the, from the screen. And I was just having too many problems. So we're gonna be using Google. Go and create a blank one, okay? And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna insert, which I already have, you're gonna go down right here into images. And this is a, if you have a, a Google account at Gmail, this is a very nice uh, program that you can use. I do all by invoices for the house cleaning business. And I used to do the invoices for the mommy's designs uh, business. And this, this one keeps everything in file and not necessarily in here, but in, the, in their own system. Uh, uh, so we're gonna go image, upload image. The first thing that we're gonna do is I'm gonna choose which clock and I believe this is the one I chose. These are some clocks that I, that I downloaded, okay? And I'm gonna be doing that. Um, I also have, if you, look in, if you look here, I have a circle, it's just a plain circle. So I'm just gonna go here and I'm gonna go ahead and open that. Okay, so I already have my image here. And if you're using uh, Google Docs, you need to click on the image and then you're gonna go right here where it says image options and click on that. And it's gonna give you all these different options to the right. Okay, so it's giving me the size and the rotation. So I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna move it to 7.3. So now we're gonna um, we're gonna unclick the the this line that is showing us the image. Make sure that is not is not highlighted, and then we go and choose another image. Upload from computer. I have my image on my downloads. We open it, and there it is. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna go below the image. Below the image that we. Um, that we just downloaded and we're gonna click again right in the middle part where it says wrap um, text and then we're gonna start bringing it up. If you have it, if you have it clicked that right here on, on the first one on the left, it's not gonna let you put any image over the clock. You need to go like right, both of them have to be like right in the middle. So since you have it here, then you can go ahead and and play with whatever size you want. Um, I want to be able to see then the uh, then all the three numbers and maybe the lines. So I may want to put the the little stones right here. Okay, and then plus the paper is gonna be glitter. So I feel like it's probably gonna be too busy and I don't, I just don't want that, okay? So make sure that both of them are right in the middle. So there it is. Okay, so you're gonna put, I'm gonna put my glitter paper up, upside down and we're gonna go ahead and print it. Welcome back, here it is our image. Okay. If you look at if you look at it closely, here is the mark where the uh, the hole is gonna go, so it's not gonna interfere with her face. Here is my circle. So now let's go ahead and go like right in the middle, like so. It was right about there. There. We are gonna put the double-sided glue. 
and I'm only going to put it like right with the 12 is at right with where the each number is at so it's four pieces of tape going to go ahead and put this where they belong so there's the first one there's the second one right there and then we're going to go ahead and put this thing it doesn't have a battery yet but here is everything there it is And now I'm going to go ahead and glue. I'm going to put just one, one drop of glue in each, in each one of the, the numbers. The image is done, it's right there. Look at how pretty it looks. All we need to do is go ahead and put all our screws and everything where it belongs. okay here it is look at how beautiful it looks so these because i put the uh, swarovski uh, beads around it i'm going to be charging uh 18.99 if it didn't have the the rhinestones like this i will probably uh, sell it for like 14.99 okay and make sure that your image when you settle it down that the 12 goes goes right where where this area is where you're going to hang it okay that's one thing that you need to remember but here it is you guys it's already done thank you so much for watching i appreciate it if you like the content of my videos please subscribe if you haven't share and give me thumbs up i would really appreciate it for now thank you very much have a blessed 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 day and may the lord bless you and your family and stay safe Thank you.